Today on Busy Bee TV, we prepare my night vapor. Whoosh. I'm back. Hello, my name is Lucas Weekly, and welcome to Busy Bee TV. Um, first, it's over now, and it's been about two months since I made the last episode. And so now I'm coming back to you with how I repair my night vapor. So, of course, I've been flying in the time that I've been absent from these videos. Why wouldn't I? But um, I've been always coming back late at night and it's always been dark. So the night vapor was the only plane that I could fly. So um, I obviously crashed it a little bit. And you might remember from my night vapor video that I told that I broke the elevator. Well, today, along with the gearbox for the propeller, I'm going to show you how to fix your night vapor. So let's get into that. Whoosh. For the first part of our repair, we need the elevator and replacement landing gear. First, remove the control linkages from the elevator and rudder. Then slide off the little rubber tube holding the rudder in place and set the rudder aside. Now you can remove the broken elevator. Carefully remove the plastic piece that held the rudder and elevator in place with an X-Acto knife. Now I mixed up some 5 minute epoxy and applied it to the carbon rod. Then I slid on the new elevator assembly and made sure everything was square. While you wait for the glue to dry, pull out the old landing gear and simply snap in the new one. There is a notch that will guide you in the direction that the wheel should go in. Put the rudder back in the way you took it off. Reconnect the linkages and you're done. Let's move on to the gearbox assembly. I noticed that everything was fine for the gearbox except for the motor shaft. So all I did was unscrew the motor shaft. and took off the new motor shaft from the new gearbox. The links to the parts I used in this video are available in the description. Now all I had to do was slide in the new motor shaft and attach the nut. Remember that the threads on the shaft and for the nut are opposite of what they should be, so it's lefty tidy, righty loosey. The prop simply screws on. And to attach the cowling, simply put a dab of hot glue on the inside and press it onto the propeller. Then I reinforced it with a little bit more hot glue. Okay, so there you go. Nice quick and easy fix and now it's all ready to fly again. So I hope that helped and thanks for watching.